Well, our next guest is shining the spotlight and empowering people in the African American community in Connecticut. We're happy to be joined by Tashe Simone, who is going to explain her vision for a brand new magazine that's launching this weekend, Black People Rock Magazine. Tashe, welcome here to CT Style. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. This is yes. such a cool concept. You're from Bridgeport, and, yes. and we want to give you a big shout out because you said you watch CT Style on Channel 8 all oh, the time. Of course. But it's cool because you're trying to shine a positive spotlight in the community. Yeah, here definitely. In definitely. There's just so much negativity going on and around the world and social media. Media. So I wanted to do something to just say, we see you, we celebrate you, and you do rock, and we want to shine a light on you and just get your story out there yeah. and, and promote your businesses. Even you better. So the <laughs> first episode, the first uh, copy is going to be released this Saturday. This Saturday. Very exciting. Yes. You're going to have a party to go along with that? Yes, yeah, a big launch party. It's going to be amazing. Cool. And it's going to be digital and printed, yes. and, and that's where this Saturday, if you guys want to go, you can get the printed version of this, but it's neat. Kind of break it down for us. So it's every two months. Every two months. You're going to launch these really unique stories about people in the community that yes. are doing really interesting things. Give us a couple yes. examples of, of what people will be able to see. Um, you can definitely get to see hair, you can get to see people um, doing um, makeup, you can see restaurants, you can see um, just politicians. Uh, we're going to be covering everything in and around the world. I want to let people know that we have amazing things going on regardless of what you see or hear, but there are some people doing some truly, truly great things in the world. Um, like we have Marquel Middleton who um, does a um, great mentorship for boys with um, Kappa League. And then, like I said, I want to definitely get the story out there about Dylan Chadwick, um, who was homeless, and now he's been accepted to 17 colleges. So we want to shine a light on those people. And we have Bobby Brown, who's in Bridgeport, and she has an amazing movement going on with 100 Girls Leading. So there's so many people I can yeah. name, and we'll be here all day. <laughs> right. But I just want to let you guys know that look out for these people's story, because you're going to be blown away. And who's on the cover for the first edition? We can't. Oh, it's a secret. Oh. It's a oh. launch. It's the launch. <laughs> Every, okay. Like, you won't get to see anything until that day. Okay, right. okay. okay. Yeah. And, and give us some details about this Saturday. So this is when the event's going down. Um, when you walk in there, you're going to hear some music. Um, you're going to get free massages. Oh, oh bonus. Yes. Yes. We'll be there. So, so where is it being held? What, it's going to be at the German Club in Bridgeport on okay. 416 Horace Street. Got it. All right, yes. cool. And, and it's nice because it's affordable. Because yes. it's, it's, what, three ninety nine for the digital version? For the digital version, which comes out online in April, and then you can get a printed copy for six ninety nine. So you definitely you need to be in the building. You can contact me um, at blackpeoplerockct at gmail .com if you would like to get a ticket to come to the event. The tickets are can I say a price? Sure, twenty dollars. Nice. Oh, there you go. Bonus. <laughs> so, wow. so what inspired you to do this? Because there's a lot of different magazines out there. What makes yeah. this one different? Um. I make it different. Yeah. You, you know, go. I'm unique. So I, I, I'm a very big fan of other magazines. I watch them, but I just wanted to do something um, great in around my community. Um, I started in 2017 with Black People Rock, and we started out with 25 vendors. Mm. Um, we had eight speakers and about 80 guests. And then in 2018, I revamped Black People Rock, and I honored 60 people in and around the community. Mm -hmm. So this time around, I said, what better way than to keep shining light on people I do a magazine right. and I said that will keep the story going and let sure. them know about so many amazing people. That's Very awesome ambitious stuff. to start a magazine, yeah. right? Yeah. I, I think you need a spotlight for all the awesome work that, that you're doing. I mean, it's, it's great that you're able to bring the community together <laughs> yeah. and, and we hear there's going to be possibly like a podcast and videos coming down the pipeline as well. So congrats yes. on all your success. Yes, definitely. Very cool. Tashay, thank you so much for joining I'm us so and excited. also big shout out to HK High School guys. Make some noise. Thank you again for stopping <laughs> by. We'll see you tomorrow. CT Style. Have a great day, everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you.